So I just want to go ahead and start off and say, for everybody that hates doing things twice, I had to do this twice. So I came out here to enjoy this view, beautiful view, and I had on a little button-up shirt with a collar. I don't know if any of y'all ever ridden with a collar on, but um, when you're going down the road and it doesn't have the little buttons to hold it in place, it just flaps and it just irritates you going flappity 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 down the road and it just kept hitting my helmet so the whole time i'm trying to talk in moto vlog i'm getting irritated by this flapping noise so i actually went all the way home dropped this shirt off came back out here to do this video once again that's a beautiful view out here so i can't get too mad and i'm on my bike so with that said let's go ahead and get started So yeah, anyway, so we're in the college shirt, lesson learned, I should have known better, I won't be doing that again, I got all, I had to go all the way home, and it was like, it took me like 10, 15 minutes to get home, they come all the way back out here, so anyway, so you won't see none of that, but I'm out here at Lake Chesney Campground, it's like 20 minutes down the road from my house, this is one of our, uh, another beautiful roads out here in Virginia, it's 70 degrees today, and I'm enjoying every bit of it. So, anyways, taking off in fast fashion like I always do, I want to go ahead and start off with. So, bought the bike 2017. I got 20,000 miles on it right now. When I first bought the bike, I was working weekends, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. I had all week to go ride, and I put a ton of miles on it when I was, you know, I had off all week. That's all I did was ride, 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 ride. Especially since it's my first bike, that's all I wanted to do was ride, 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 ride. It's very addicting, as everyone knows. Well, I switched to the week shift, so now I'm working Tuesday through Friday. And really my only day to ride is Sunday because Saturday family day Monday I had to take care of business stuff and um, I got squeezed my editing time in there somewhere too so basically now my time is just broken down to if I'm riding I might as well I gotta squeeze my voter vlog in too so I give you guys the content that you're looking for um, so back to the bike I got 20,000 miles on the bike and I want to go ahead and say and point out and stick up for a Harley Davidson 20,000 miles on this bike I haven't had any issues no leaking oil or anything like everybody always says and I drive this bike hard you know high rpms constantly and I push this bike and I had it hasn't broke down on me yet so I can't even say like oh the only issue I had is no the only thing I've really had to spend on this bike is the aftermarket parts that I bought and put on here from my pipes and stuff to oil changes like I haven't even changed the brakes on this thing yet 20,000 miles I'm still running on the same original brake pads so I'm be doing that soon um, the wheel bearings I'm still running on the same wheel bearings which I definitely want to change those soon because the way I ride I probably should have changed them a lot sooner than what's recommended I gotta tell you though, that shirt that I was just griping about from in the beginning, it just irritated the crap out of me. Like, I don't know if you've ever ridden down the road with one of those collar shirts and it's not buttoned down. The collar just kept flapping and flapping and flapping. And I was trying to motor vlog like this and I was just irritated by the sound. And not to mention, I don't even know if like it affected the quality or not, but whatever. Anyways, moving on. So, in my last vlog, I was telling you guys about the t-shirts I had for sale. I think a couple of y'all actually called up there and um, asked the guy if he'd mail them to y'all because he was telling me about that. Oh, let me slow down around here. Nice little campground. But uh, the owner of the shop, Pro Street Cycles, he was telling me, he goes, yeah, I had some people call it asking if I'd mail some shirts and um, I can't afford to do that. So, well, he didn't really have the time to do it. It wasn't even about pricing, but... But I want to say I appreciate everybody, you know, calling or even like we sold a bunch of shirts just these past 
two weeks or so. So we're already working on the new design to push that out. And I think you guys will like it. I, I'm sorry I can't mail them out to you right now. We're definitely going to work on something. So we're working on a new shirt design that'll be coming out. I really like it. It's a, a big wheel bagger kind of look. So I know a lot of you guys are y'all follow the channel for the sports shirt. But please just check it out. I think you'll like it. Woo! And um yeah, 20,000 miles on the bike. I know I'm all over the place right now. I'm just enjoying the day and <laughs> I pretty much repeat myself because I went through this whole motor vlog talking just to find out I gotta do it all over again but I don't think y'all really watch the channel listen to me talk anyways I think y'all just like the bike and once again I ride it hard 20,000 miles and this thing is still running strong I like my Harley. Is it going to keep up with sports bikes? Probably not, which I ride with a couple of them and uh, yeah, they smoke me. They leave me behind every time. But I just like my old machine or the feel. It feels like an old machine. I like that feel, that look. So, eh. All right. So. Stop at the old stop sign. Then we take a left. And the car go a little bit. I just want to take this time to give a shout out to my sponsors. And it's a very short list because I don't have any. But if you're watching and interested in sponsoring Shift and State, I'd love to hear from you. Um yeah, let that car go. So moving on, take it off. And now I have two ventures which I'd like to bring up. One actually belongs to my wife. My wife is uh, opening up like a little small boutique kind of thing. Don't you do it, don't you do it. Have one of those moments. Um, so my wife's opening up a boutique and I actually encourage her to start her own YouTube channel. In my own, yeah, how do I put this? So uh, I basically, had, I encouraged her to start her own YouTube channel, not thinking that I would be the one editing that. So that's a new responsibility. Um, it's a new channel. If uh, your wife is interested in clothing, go check out her channel. It's called Daffodil. Daffodil with no S Boutique And I'll be editing that So you can see my beautiful wife Go subscribe Give her some likes Views, help her out Um So yep I got that going on Ride my bike So another maintenance thing That I gotta do to this bike And I'm gonna do that when I get home I don't know if y'all wanna see a video on it Even care but my primary chain I gotta check that I think it's a little loose I think I hear some clinking going on down there I'm gonna go home and tighten that up after the bike cools off and other than that I really don't have a lot to talk about today but I'm sure I can figure out something mumble on ramble on to go out and this summer I'm looking forward to like riding out to the beach and everything I think you guys will definitely like that view I know y'all enjoying the country roads and stuff that I have out here I know y'all enjoy them because I enjoy them a lot of twisties the only thing I don't like I know these back roads but the only thing I don't like and I'm sure like some of y'all feel this way too is a lot of these back roads, you can tell, rocky driveway, rocky driveway, them rocks end up in the road and I'd hate to be coming around on these corners and just catch one. And I actually can't believe 
I almost forgot to tell you guys about this. Thank you guys for watching, subscribing, telling your friends, whatever it may be, because I finally hit 4,600 subscribers, and you know, every time I hit one of those little milestones, I get excited. And when I get excited, it makes me want to go out and do a, another video, whatever it may be. And it, it makes me feel good because like, hey, you guys are actually watching my stuff. You actually enjoy what I'm doing. And I'm happy about it because I enjoy doing this. It's a lot of fun. I mean, it is a lot of work too. But I really do enjoy motor vlogging. Like, I can't believe like, I've been doing this since like 2018 and like I mean I should have just motor vlogged instead of like trying to do all this extra stuff. Hold on. Woo! I love those turns. Love them. Oh. <laughs> so I'm going to cut it off right there guys because I rambled on it. Like I said I don't really have a whole lot to talk about today but next time I'm going to find a whole list of things to talk to you about. But I was just excited about the shirts and I want to kind of brag about, you know, my Harley a little bit, you know, it's very reliable in my point. It hasn't let me down yet. And I think basically what it comes down to is take care of the machine, the machine will take care of you. With that all said, thank you guys for watching. Hit that subscribe button. Uh, I guess there's a notification bell, so hit that too, so you can be notified when I post a new video. So. Once again, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking, guys. And I'm stuck behind a bank.